All right, guys. I've got to do some more cutting. I gotta cut this frame. Cut that side. I'm gonna cut this side over here. I just marked it. I've gotta lower my front end down. But uh, hmm. it's starting to fit here. I might be able to get the inner cooler in the front if I can get it to fit in behind the fenders there, because there is a lot of room on the sides. The inner cooler is pretty thin, pretty wide. It's only like 22 inches tall, if I remember right. Like 36 from the core. Crossed, so that kind of sticks out a little more for the tubes, but I mean, it'll, um, it's 37 inches from that side of the fender to the other side of the fender, or from here to the other side. And that's what it's supposed to be. <clears throat> and I've got my little grill up there just holding for a kind of an idea, holding things together a little bit. <clears throat> my cab looks good, but actually I'm gonna have to uh, raise it back up in the rear, I think. Either that or I'm gonna have to cut the front underneath where it meets the uh sits on the frame right there i might end up cutting that section of the cab and folding it up and boxing it i mean it's nothing that anybody can see and the floorboard is actually like six seven inches up above that so um that'll be a little bit of work but i think i can pull that off that way I can tuck the cab lower and lower onto here. Yeah, you can probably see it better from this side. Let's see if I can zoom into it. Wrong way. Right there where it sits on the frame. I can cut that up and I can drop it another two inches. But um, let me get this side of the frame cut off and I'll be able to lower the front end down. I don't have a lot of room. I'm going to have to relocate the alternator. Um, my throttle, which is nothing to it. I mean, you can mount that thing pretty much anywhere. <clears throat> I can actually mount it on the firewall if I want, or the back of the motor. Um, I'm going to have to build me a horn, which shouldn't be too awful hard. I'll figure it out. And the turbo is going to be awfully close on the clearing. That's probably going to be my um, deciding factor on where the cab's going to go, is where the turbo is going to hit the fender. So, and it's um, pretty close. So, I'm thinking I've got just a little bit. Once I cut this frame off, I can drop the front end down just a little bit, and I'm going to have to actually. <clears throat> raise the cab maybe or I don't know we'll figure it out if I come forward with it some more because um, once I come down with the front end this back of the fender will go back to it actually you can see where it lines up on the cab over there. that fender needs to go down to the front a good inch and a half so all right let's get the cutting on this so we can lower the front. The carnage, the pieces, the parts. All 